Hi, Shimoki. Say hi, guys. I wanted to share some of my current favorite lip products that I've been using. I have some lip liners, glosses of sorts, and then I shared about these before. I'm just briefly going to mention them again. These are the Stay In Lip Liners from Secho. They did send them to me. You can get them on Ulta. You can get them on their website. I think you can get them on Amazon as well. And my favorite one is 01 Nude and 02. When you apply them, they're really dark and you have to let them dry for up to 15 minutes and then you peel them off and you're left with kind of like a lip stain. And these are meant to be used as lip liners, but I actually use it all over the lips, just not on the wet part because then it's never gonna dry down and it's gonna last you basically all day. So these are really, really nice if you want something that's really long lasting transfer proof you just put a gloss on top it gives your lips like a nice tint i'll show you guys how this peels off when it dries down okay, some lip pencils that i've been loving is the glossier lip liner i bought it because a lot of people mentioned how long lasting it is and i got it in shade buff which is a darker i would say nude brown it's this one right here these are actually previous swatches from this morning i scrubbed and i scrubbed and i scrubbed i just did a youtube shorts on it they are so long lasting these are the maybelline ones and I will say this one is like a creamy dry formula. It's not super dry like the NYX ones, NYX, but it's not super duper creamy like some other lip liners that I have tried. And it does dry down pretty fast. Like once you apply it, you kind of got to work fast. It feels creamy, like doesn't feel super crumbly, but it's not as creamy as the Maybelline ones. And you are able to kind of buff it into the lips a little bit if you want more of a softer look. But you kind of got to work fast. And this one does last. I mean, it's still a lip liner. It's not a liquid lipstick. It's not going to last you all day. You are going to have to touch it up if you're eating. Oh no, are we fighting? Are we fighting? But I will say the hype around it is real. I do think it is a really good lip liner. And I've tried quite a few. And this one definitely lived up to the hype in my opinion. But it's kind of expensive. So then I kept seeing everybody talk about the lifter liner pencils. And I saw them first on Amazon when they first released. And I wasn't sure if I wanted to try it or not. But then I kept seeing everybody talk about them, so I'm like, you know what, I'm going to try them out. So you can pick these up on Amazon, you can find them at your local Walmart probably, I believe Ulta. And now he's playing with like something over there. These are so worth it. I think they're like $7 if you get them on Amazon. They're originally, I think, 9 if you get them at Walmart. And I got mine originally in the shade Out of Line, which is more of like a mauve nude shade right here. It's really nice. It matches my natural lips fairly well I would say like let me outline the tip here so if you want something for fall time you don't want anything too light you want like a medium mauve nude I would say this is a really good shade and then I also got it in the shade on it this one is closer to the glossier one this one is a darker shade it's this one right here this is the glossier one this is out of line and this is on it these two are from Maybelline this one's from glossier I love the formula on these when you first apply it they are creamy but you get some time to kind of like play around with them before they set down and they have equal staying power in my humble opinion to the glossy ones but at a fraction of the price the only thing is the shade range it's not like they only have a few shades so if you're not into any of the shades you might not be able to find a shade you like i personally like the shades that i got and i like the shade range i love this for fall darker brown but not like a true brown more of a dark mauve brown i like to line my lips like this and then apply gloss over which i'll do in a little bit but these 100 percent worth it if you love lip liners they're only seven dollars if you get them on amazon i think they're like nine dollars everywhere else original price and then i just apply gloss i've been loving the nyx butter gloss in madeline this one i got on amazon as well who remembers the butter glosses but this one's nice because it's a kind of like a true nude honestly and it pairs so beautifully with all of these lip liners i mean look at that that is so gorgeous let me swatch it on the back of my hand this is the gloss right here so again out of line on it and then we have the glossier one here these two are similar this one's a little bit more brown and darker another gloss i've been loving is the natrium phytoglow lip balms this is part of the latte collection or this is the shade latte it's part of the i think fall collection she launched them sometime last year i think people don't talk about these because they love like their summer fridays and all the other ones ula henriksen has taken over but honestly i feel like these are so good so this one's a little bit pinkier than the nyx butter gloss so if you want something pink this will be your bet. This would pair beautifully with Out of Line from NYX. The Secho Lip Stain actually dried down, so let me peel it off. I to get the tip going and then you peel it off. So this is the shade 01 Nude. You can see it's a very nice light nude and it will just give your lips a nice stain. It basically lasts all day. You just got to make sure to leave it on for 15 minutes because if you take it off too soon, you're not really going to get the color payoff that you want. But yeah, all of these right here have been some of my favorite current lip products. I feel like they're really nice 
neutral tones for fall time there are some reds but that's like a whole different category maybe i'll do a different video on but if you're interested in lip products then i hope this video was helpful I just wanted to do like a short video i'll link any of the products down below thanks for watching and i really hope to see you guys in future videos